Gonna take my first AMP1 exam. I feel confident I'll get at least a C. And when you're trying to take this many classes at once, that is good enough. Well, first I took a picture instead of a video. And then I was like, hmm, the screen looks kind of icky. And then I used my thumb and I like cleaned it off and whoa, big improvement. Look in the background. Look at that. I can't zoom in. Look at that. I can't pan either. It's flowers. It's flowers from Chris. Cause he knows it's been a little tough lately. Gonna wish me good luck in the background while I take my first A&P exam. And look at this. Nothing looks better than a man in the kitchen. <laughs> what you cooking? Ramen noodles. Ramen noodles, I love it. It tastes delicious, cause I didn't fix them. Okay, so, gonna take my first AMP1 exam. Feel so much better about this than my first chemistry exam. I don't know if I'll get an A, but I feel confident I'll get at least a C, probably a B, maybe an A. And when you're trying to take this many classes at once, that is good enough. So how have I studied for this? I made my kids listen to the lectures on the way to Eckerd's and I listened to Mr. W. Cell song. It's great if you need to learn about the cell, you need to listen to Mr. W. Cell song. Uh, you can put a link in the description, buddy. Uh, sure. Link in the description. My kids hate that song. It <laughs> sticks in your head though, it will help you. And then today I listened to the lectures again, like on time and a half and double speed. And it doesn't take long to listen to all of them, at least for the first unit. Quizlet has great flashcards already made up for you. I did a little bit of that and I printed out the practice module and read over it a little bit, but I didn't even read over all of it. I feel like I got it good enough. So, and I think you can see the answers as soon as you're done, but I mean, the practice test, you can see the answers. I'm not sure which things they count right or wrong. Like, what are the six levels of organization or something? Well, I put like atom, molecule, cell, uh, tissue, organ. I don't know what I put. It was in the notes, like it was in the video. But then her answer was chemical, cellular, tissue, organ, organ system, organism. I remember the correct answer. But I mean, I feel like they've had a lot of overlap in those answers. So I don't know the difference between the first list I said and the second list I said, but they have a lot of the same things. So I feel like if she was judging, I still would have got partial credit for that. And my chemistry test I took Sunday. Today's Tuesday? I don't know. Yeah. Today's Tuesday. My chemistry test I took Sunday, I took almost the full two hours for it and it was brutal. And honestly, I thought I probably got better than the 70, but I was hoping like for an 80 and I got an 87. Like I got a lot of partial credit for knowing how to get halfway to the answer. So let's see how I do on A and P. And then we'll eat some ramen noodles and we'll look at some pretty flowers and we'll ramble some more. So Chris has to edit out a lot of stuff. Let's hear you in the picture. Look at him hard at work, crunching them ramen noodles. <sighs> I feel much better before this quiz than I did before my chemistry two exam. Whoa. And tomorrow morning, I hired a tutor on pre-ply to help me with chemistry because I hate chemistry. So we're gonna see what an hour with a tutor does to help me get ready for module three, see if it's worth it. Talk to you later. So they haven't graded AMP yet, but you can see the right answers and pretty sure I got an A, if not a B plus. If spelling counts, more likely a B, but yeah, that was not that bad at all. I think I can fly through AMP way faster than chemistry, which is very relieving. It feels great. So now it's time to do something fun. No more studying today. What's we gonna do? Raylan, do you see you? You see you? You say, I see me. You did move your mouth. Extra close up. You didn't say anything? You look so beautiful. Okay, that's all.